to be like Jesus. Seek divine wisdom in handling money. June 25th. His Lord said to him, Well done, good and faithful servant. You were faithful over a few things. I will make you ruler over many things. Enter into the joy of your Lord. Matthew 25 verse 21 Brother C is in a responsible position, but if the members of the family to which he has allied himself in marriage will prove true to him, they will influence him to become a wise steward of his Lord's goods. Then he will bestow his means as if in the view of the whole universe of heaven. He will not participate in any unlawful scheme for making money, but will move with an eye single to the glory of God. He will eschew all petty tricks to avoid all mean, dishonest devices and will do nothing that will in any way work against the cultivation of true piety. He will realize that all his business transactions lie within the domain of God. We must not lose sight of the fact that stewards are to trade with their Lord's goods and that they are handling a sacred responsibility. The Bible requires that people buy and sell and transact all their business with as keen a sense of religious obligation as they have when offering up petitions to their Heavenly Father, asking for strength and grace. The Lord has not left any to do as they please with their goods, and to give as impulse shall dictate, or as friends may demand. The money they handle is not theirs, and is not to be expended unnecessarily. For the vineyard of the Lord is to be worked, and its working requires the expenditure of means. Now is our day of trust, and the day of reckoning is yet to come. The Lord has entrusted means to his stewards to be used wisely. For all are moral urgents and are required to bear responsibilities. Our varied trusts are given in proportion to our ability to use. But we are not to use God's means merely for the gratification of selfish desires and as inclination may dictate. Brother C has failed at times in the past in handling his Lord's goods and has not always considered whether he was using the money entrusted to him in a way that would please his master in advance the cause of truth. He must give an account of how he disposes of the means given in trust to him. He cannot study his own will in this matter. He must seek wisdom from God. To be like Jesus.